We just survived three nights in uh, Moab. We're at Goose Island, and what's crazy is it's February, and uh, our, my little family of four had a great time. And I kind of want to give you a tour of our layout and, and so you can see how we're doing it, especially if this helps give you ideas, because this van is available for rent on uh, Luna Rover CamperVanRentals.com. Uh, links in the description. I think this van is perfect for four people, for two adults and two little little people. Let me give you a quick overview of the, how we've been living the last three nights here. And it's February, so it's been cold. Overnight temps have been around 20 degrees, and we've been toasty warm. Uh, the diesel heater is just fantastic. I can't say enough good things to say about that. This little space, I would consider like the size of a spaceship. <laughs> you know, it is, it is tight, but it's been working. So let me give you a tour. So we do have the cab bunk bunk set up, and this is where the boys have slept. 10 year old here, six year old down there. Um, and they did good the first night. Second night, they did not do so great. The top one did great, but this one was not. And I figured out my mistake is I had the back seats reclined too far. So that was like bunching this one up. And so the little one was just kind of in this taco instead of in the full bunk. See how the seats, they have to be kind of more upright. I bought these blackout shelves, blackout curtains, I mean. And um, they clip on with these giant vice grips that I got at Walmart. And it is good if you don't want to set up the the front covers, you could just put these on and drape it over the, the seats. But what we've been doing in the morning is clipping them up so that we can make coffee and and have our kind of space in the morning for, and the boys can sleep in. Uh, coffee station with an espresso sink. Everything's here. Everything is kind of jammed in. I have all the plates and stuff here and then some food jammed in. Um, it definitely needs some organizing. I guess what you'd affectionately call the breakfast nook. Boys have been have traveling here. This is, you know, has seat belts for two, but it is a tight bench. I wish there was a better bench for the kids. And then here we got the control panel. And again, the diesel heater and the hot water, perfect. No issues, no nothing. Um, battery has been really um, full. We haven't had any freezing issues. Um, battery charges shoulder solar so it's been great I brought plenty of food beer and uh, yesterday somebody somebody asked questions about the van and then gave us uh, a bunch of Utah beer which has been great and then here in this uh, pantry you know, like chips snacks and then toilet cleaning kind of items the bathroom for four people has been uh, working pretty well. We took, we removed the shelf and took showers this morning. So it was pretty good. We've been keeping it like this. There's some RV antifreeze for when we get back. And I've been keeping this shelf here uh, as well as when we're driving, put it as a gate here just to kind of keep this stuff locked in. So I put the bed down. We have been sleeping, obviously, in the bed um, <laughs> at night, two adults. It's a full-size bed, but it's been been fine. Um, a key is I have this body pillow, and this you can use on the bench as a kind of a backrest, but we've been stuffing it uh, along the back of the van, um, almost like a place to put your and stretch out just a little more uh, since over here and I can show you over here is almost like a little uh, valley or hole. The 
this is all our winter gear uh, laptop bag dirty clothes some beer uh, and then I said this is all camping supplies and on the other side everybody got assigned a bin for their clothes um, but literally it should be this it should be flipped and then we have these um, uh, cozy things there's baby Yoda uh, charging station right there has been good uh, nice little window so this has been just fantastic this has been a critical part of having the van and I really if we would have had to just kind of Tetris ourselves in the front. I don't think the experience would have been as good. Uh, so my wife Becky has been enjoying some uh, uh, time back here. The kids had a great time last night while we, the adults, were outside enjoying a fire. It was 30 degrees. It was a little chilly, but we were we were enjoying the fire. The boys were in here, sitting here, and I set up an iPad right here, and they watched the movie, and it, it was wonder, wonderful. And I'm sure you're going to you know, hear about uh, somebody, me or my wife, doing a Zoom call back here if we have to work in here. So if, if you like the idea of this kind of camping, especially in fair weather, this is going to be amazing with the, the back doors open um, and spending more time outside. If it's this great in February, it's going to be really great in the summer months. So you can rent this van, this very van, and we keep it very clean and nice for you, at, at Luna Rover Camper Van Rental. Luna is ready for you, fully stocked and, and ready to go. So again, that link's in the description if you want to rent the van. And if you have any questions about how we set it up or any of the mods, feel free to ask in the comments. Thanks for watching.